Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about Citibank and more specifically, we're talking about how to lock your Citibank credit card. So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off, if you're not familiar with Citibank, it is one of the largest banks in the US. It might be international, I'm not too sure. If you happen to know, be sure to leave a comment below. But what we're talking about is how to lock your city credit card. So why would you need to do that? Well, that's a pretty easy question to answer. If you're like me and you're a dummy and have lost or misplaced your credit card, you know how much of a hassle it is to order a new credit card from the bank, only to find out a few days later that the credit card or debit card was in your pants wallet or maybe in the laundry. And what happens is if you report the card lost or stolen, then the bank closes the account down completely and changes the credit card number and then you have to wait for a new one to be mailed to you. The nice thing about these days is you can report your card as a freeze and what that does is it freezes the account to help avoid any new transactions on that card and then if you happen to find it a few days later then you can just unfreeze the account. And the neat thing about that is the credit card number stays the same, the expiration date and the three digit code remain the same. So here's an example of that. So if you are using your card out on the weekend and then you wake up the next day and you don't have your card in your wallet, you can immediately put a freeze on it. And that way, if you left it at the bar or at a restaurant, whoever has that card, they can't go out and purchase things at Target. So how do you do that? First off is you can actually take care of this through the mobile app. Here's the mobile app for City. It's this blue, white, and red one. If you don't have the app already, be sure to check the video description. I'll try to leave a link there, but I'm gonna go ahead and open the app now. All right, here's the app right now, the home screen, and what you wanna do is go ahead and log in. If you have your thumbprint or your face ID registered, you can use that. I'm gonna go ahead and enter my credentials now. All right, I went ahead and entered my password. I'm gonna go ahead and log in now. All right, so I've logged into my credit card account. This is the home screen. So it's gonna go over things like your current balance, your available credit, your credit limit, a lot of different options, including making a payment, but we're not gonna worry about that. What you wanna do is click right here on the bottom left. City makes it really easy. It's called lock card and it just floats on top of the menu. So it's one of the first options that you can choose when you log into your credit card account. So I'm gonna go ahead and click there now. All right, I went ahead and clicked there and this is the information that pops up right here. So one thing I wanna make clear is locking your card is not the same as reporting it lost or stolen. So lost or stolen, what that means is the card is lost completely and there is no chance of you finding it or stolen. That's self-explanatory. If somebody steals your card from you or from your vehicle or from your house, something like that. If you report your card lost or stolen, the credit card number will change the account number will change. However, with temporarily locking your card and unlocking your card, they say it's going to block any new purchases and cash advances, and it allows recurring transactions. So if you have like a gym membership or payments, those will continue on that particular account. So how do you lock it? It's this nice little slider button right here. Actually, it looks like a slider, but it's a press button. So right now my card is active. So if I go to the store and want to buy something, it's not going to be an issue. If I want to lock it, I just click this button. I'm going to click there now. All right, once you click that button, it says right here that turns from green to red, and now it says locked. And also I get this pop-up that says your card is now locked. I'm going to click OK. All right, so now if there are any new purchases attempted with this card, it will not go through. So this is kind of a handy function, especially if you are worried about fraud or someone stealing your account. This might be a little bit overprotective, but it is an option for you to keep that locked at all times. And then if you want to make a purchase, you just click unlock, log back in and click unlocked. I'm not too worried about that. So I'm going to go ahead and unlock this card now. I'm going to click on this button. All right, now you can see this pop up. It says your card is now unlocked. I'm going to click OK. So that is how you lock and unlock your city credit card. If you feel like it might be lost or you're having trouble finding it, if you know an easier way to lock and unlock your city credit card, be sure to leave me a comment below. Let the rest of us know. Hopefully you found the video useful. If so, click thumbs up and hope to see you on the next one. Thanks again for watching.